Una cerca peinando en los espejos del río. En todo la caminando entre la jara con Against the church. Oh, you didn't. 
the law says tax all profits equally, so I did. The law? This gentleman has empty rooms in his head. They'll burn him at high noon, and if I were there, I'd light up the fire. What? Let's go off to the trial, shall Excuse me, what trial? Yours, of course. What have I done? Oh, we'll find something. Oh, that's not fair. Fair is for the innocent. You are guilty. What kind of sentence? We usually find a prisoner of all his possessions. All of them? What's not practical to take more, is it? One moment. These things are my livelihood. I thought you said you were a poet? Oh, a theater. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Costumes and properties. You see, actually, I'm a playwright and an actor. These are the trappings of my profession, so they could not be any use to. to. Uh, very well, take it. But only leave me. No, not this, not this, this. This? Timmy, valuable. Well, to me. Well, we might let you run some it. But I have no money. Well, how unfortunate. Hooray, hooray! Yes, yes. I now, demand the jury. You have one. Imagine of those who will judge him. Certainly. Why not? The scorpion, cutthroat, murderer. Here's my knife. A body, there's a bad one, or a bad one, it lists in the world. <gasps> ah, yes. Mother Bane. Your specialty mother? The evil eye, take my advice and live for a long, long time. Because the man is fit, a man can do his life, he still lets himself die. Well, that is superb the evil. And Medico, show him how you operate. I've always had the doctors, they're the only ones who can take our lives without the fear of uh, uh, punishment. Anyone you need to be scarred, the doctor charges by an inch. The gypsy pickpocket thief. Oh. I'd watch your I can steal you. your watch while you're looking at it. Uh, how fortunate I do not own one. And finally, Judy McAveo, professional slanderer. Well, I can tell you that the first crime is self evident, <laughs> but a professional slanderer? Engage my services. Now we spread stories about him that ruin his business, his reputation, and we're going to ruin his life. Ooh. So much competition. A jury to hang the whole human race. And the judge? Highly qualified. I spent more time in court than most lawyers. And that gentleman? The Duke, not really one of us. Name? <laughs> James William Fox, nationality, English. Obviously, oh, obviously, that's how you're speaking to us. Profession, traitor. Uh, you are to appear before the Inquisition? How annoying to be charged with false gods when one is not at all. Oh, I'm sorry. How do you know some governess, if you don't know, I should like to prosecute this case. Certainly, I declare this court in session. Yeah. Yeah. At that point, and the next man, how plead you? Oh, guilty. <gasps> Excellent! It is the sentencing of this court that. Your Excellency, what about my defense? But you just pleaded. If I had said innocent, you surely would have found me guilty. But now that I've admitted my guilt, they are required to hear me out. For what purpose? They may choose to be lenient. Clever. He's trying to gain time. Do you have the scarcity of that? Any errors in that point, no. man? No. This crippled hand. Uh, I was truly born as an example of misfortune, and that's how I learned that hope is born at the same time as love. Oh, <laughs> how very touching. So I turned to the pen, and then I fell in love. Aww. Aww. The final disaster. She was an actress in the company, but I learned that love was a happy torment. She left me. <laughs> you look really wrong to life's advantage. What should have I looked for? There is only one thing <gasps> Good! Yeah! yeah! Never betrays! I know a courtesy better than that. Then name it imagination. <laughs> Oh, what? Raising 
can hold a man's imagination, I think he must be mad. Certainly. But I created a man who was, uh, a man, uh, just enter into my imagination and see. His name is Alonso Quijano, a country squire, retired. He has much time for books. He broods and broods and broods. And finally, from so much brooding, his brain dries up. He wears his old, rusted suit of armor. Well, as much peace as he could find. But he's missing something. Of course, a proper knight must have a squire. He finds one. A peasant from a neighboring farm. They mount their trusty seeds. Now he is no longer Alonso Quijano, but a dauntless knight known as Don Quixote de la Mancha. Ha <laughs> ha! 
will I encounter one enchantment with another? Forward to glory! <laughs> The most curious I have ever heard, but entertaining! Yeah. 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 I think his purpose is to divert us from ours. Precisely. May I get on with it? You may continue with your defense. Now, imagine the home of that time. Not the castle of Don Quixote, but the home of the country squire. Imagine the shock to his, uh, his niece, Antonia Cajana, or to his uh, housekeeper. And to uh, Antonia's auntie, as the dreadful, the unbelievable news reaches them. Extraordinary, an extraordinary occurrence, but we will be here about it. The farmer Garcia went to on the road. That? The master and Sancho Panza. Ah, oh, yes, Sancho Panza. He wouldn't be much help. Garcia was astonished to see the master dead as he was in spoken. Senor Pelana said, I beg you to address me in a proper way. I am Don Quixote, and I am in the service of all that is good on earth. In the service of all that is good on earth. It doesn't seem such a daring madness. Oh, it is daring madness. I suppose you're right. I'm not for your fiancé. I said for Dr. Grasco as soon as I hear the news. Very well. Then let us wait before deciding upon a course of action. Alonso Quijana, the good Alonso, the studious. Yes! That is exactly what did it. Just those books, aren't they all to be marked poison? Poison? Oh, now! Reading day and night, that's all what he did. How many times I heard him pacing the floor talking to himself. I tell him, uncle, please go to bed. He wouldn't even listen to me. <gasps> Tales of Jubilee, I know this one is a bad story. All books are bad. Look at this, my face is getting paged, being burnt like hair. Explanation? Why should I? I am a farmer, sir. This boy works for me in 
charge for my flock. Twice now he was all cheap to get lost. Therefore I am bound to punish him. So say you. And you? Sir, I, I, be not afraid, boy. Speak up. My name is Andre, sir. It is true that I left the sheep stream, but only because she refused to pay me. I call him responsible for the sheep that are missing. She is responsible, not even my pay. You is a Oh, us. 
walk now. Men. I've been thinking about you. I don't you promised to bring me a compliment to the door. Well, that was last time. It was, eh? And where is it? I bet you. I don't think it is meted. <gasps> me? No way. My mule is starting to stubborn as you are. They go talk with their mules. They were going to bring me a compliment to the door. I don't uh... Excuse me. Aha! <laughs> you steal my money as well as my heart. Oh! <gasps> 
lady and a gentleman. They inquire for me. They inquire for the man named Don Quixote de la Mancha. So soon as my babes been aboard, I thank you, Signora. I will attend upon them now. Certainly. I confess I should not know what to say to him. In that case, leave it to me. We're not in the laboratory. All the words, laboratory. And men merely specimens. He may not even know us. I am here for that reason. Should he get recognized? Who is it that calls the help of Don Quixote? Is there a castle beleaguered by giants? A king under enchantment? Or anything else that needs my help? Having done so, what is this? Ah, my friends. Wait, you know us? Should a man not know his own friends? You are the bachelor, Senor Carrasco. And you, what did you do? Then you are not. Not what? Out of your head. What? Ah, uh, Senor Quijote. I beg that you address me properly. I am Don Quixote, knight errant of the Mancha. <laughs> now, what dire circumstance has led you to seek my aid? The dire circumstance is your family. My family is all of mankind. What we're here for is to ask you to return home. Uh, my home is the whole wide world. He knows us on team, but not himself. Wrong, doctor. I know who I am and who I may be if I choose. Ask me, I said I am Don Quixote. There are no giants. No keys under the chest, no castles, no ship, no knights. There have been no knights for 300 years. That's just you saying it. These are facts. Facts are the enemy of the truth. Would you deny reality? <laughs> Which? Yours, mine, or hers? There's only one. Wrong, my friend. Reality is in the eye of the beholder. Let the devil take those who have no more use for him. Why do you do this? In the service of God, and my lady. I have some knowledge of God, but his other? My lady, Dulcinea. Oh. So there's a woman. A lady. Her beauty, more than human. Oh. Her quality, perfection. Oh. And what will this enterprise finish? When I have conquered my enemy. And what do you mean? What enemy? The enchanter. Oh. A man? He may appear as a man. And how will you know him? Oh, I will know him. And I will fight him, and I will win! Oh. Come on, it's a long way, for he is best. Senor Knight, your friends have departed. Forgive me, I am troubled. Well, have a glass of wine. No, thank you. I'll let you ah. Ah. Tell me ah. I've never been dubbed a knight, so I'm perfect for it. Oh, oh, that's bad, that's bad. I'm brave, cautious, generous, available, and patient. Yeah, that's the list. Here in the courtyard, will you hail me to become a knight? Me! Me! Yes. Me? Yes. Oh, well. Ah, uh, certainly. Certainly. Why not? Certainly, certainly. Ah, uh, now, uh, would you like some supper, senor knight? For a vigil? No. I must fast and compose oh. my spirit. For my lady, Dulcinea. Aww. Why did you call me that? My lady! I said, why did you call me that? Because it's beautiful. My name is Aldonilla. Oh, I know, lady. Your heart doesn't know much about women. A woman is glory! Oh, God. <laughs> you are mad. <coughs> and... What do you want? Uh, nothing. Liar! I ask that I may serve her, so I hold her in my heart. And so oh. that she follows the quest with me. That's for your quest, not mine, Chris. What do you mean by quest? The mission we follow. We? Surely it is yours as well as mine. To dream the impossible dream, to fight the unbeatable foe. This is a man's privilege and the only life worth living. Once, just once, would you look at me out of being armed? Running into senior gas? <gasps> I wasn't, I swear! I know better than to look at me. I, I wasn't! My lady, my friends are running the power. Oh, monster! Stay clear! Strike a woman! Go back! Well, break your empty hat! I shall punish you now! I swear to you! Ah! Monetius, did I ask you? Oh, I know the army! Come on, come on! Don't kill the will vanquish army! Ha! 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 Slow them! Slow them! We can beat them! Ah, woman! Oh, you want to get a beating? Oh, you want to get a beating? Oh, I will give you huh? I will give you a beating you never saw in your life.
your majesty. But I must remind you of your promise. Promise? True, it is not yet sunrise, but I have kept myself vigil and proven myself in combat. Therefore, I beg you, dub me knight. Oh! Certainly, let's get this over with. Sancho, the sword! Giant. 
chance? No, ma'am. I was upset by enchantment. No one, no one disguised your bravery, but only your discretion. How can you be to bribe against me? Well, wickedness was thick harder, doesn't it? Oh, Adonza, lies and <gasps> madness and lies. My lady, Adonza, what happened? Oh, ask him. Oh, how they beaten me. Oh, I shall punish them for this crime. Stuffed with proverbs. <laughs> 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 
imagine up those names? If you would say it. Alonso Quijada. Thank you. What happened to you, Alonso? Are you okay? okay? Come closer, my friends. In my dreams, I dream the most strangely. No, 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 no. I bet you're not telling you really you think I'm mad. Well, oh, Kevin, just put them from your mind. You would get well. They are gone, my dear, and nor do I know what they meant. Oh, no. <sighs> I am aware of my... You can I say you can <gasps> Thank you. 